on a roof and I want to show you quickly how to fix any leak flashing on a flat roof. Most of the leaks, 99% of leaks are from flashing and let me show you with what I found. So the material comes up here and it comes up here and then well, they stop with this membrane right here and they put tar here. So the tar cracks and I just opened this up with my scissors and I could find I found a crack. You can see tar is gonna get hard and crack. So you cannot do a transition with tar. It doesn't work that way. So let me show you an easy way to fix this. This is will last for a long time. I use turbo poly seal, okay? And first of all you have to stir this. If you don't stir it, you're gonna have trouble. And then you take a brush and you paint this on there. Look at, just like this. A brush like this. But I'm gonna do this whole section from here all the way because it will crack. And you take the fleece, I cut it, and voila. You can see, and I have repaired the flashing. This will last. Unlike the tar, that doesn't last, it gets dry. Anybody can fix. And this is flashing on an AC, but it can be chimney, it can be anything. And look at that. You don't have to do tar, tar will dry up. This is flexible, pliable, it will stretch and flex, it will never dry up, and it will never leak again. Wait, from the uh, AC curb, and it's opened up here, see? because the tar will not last. Again, I use a turbo poly seal and I apply this just over that tar. It, it, it's compatible with any asphalt tar. All right, so this is how you fix it. Right to the edge there and that's it. And I'm done. This is how you fix any leak on a flat roof. Flat through flashing, curbs, vents, it doesn't matter. Let me show you another leak. So look at the pitch pocket. The water follows right there, follows this little pipe and right in there causes a leak, okay? And the best way is just add some turbo poly seal into that hole, just like that. And that's it, that's it, I'll fix the leak. Hey, hey, Vic! How are you? See you in the next video.